This is a demonstration video of the prototype standalone nanosensor device from Dr. No Sung Myung's lab in the Chemical and Environmental Engineering Department at the University of California, Riverside. This device consists of an Arduino Nano microcontroller, a LCD screen, a temperature sensor, a humidity sensor, and a GPS module. It can be powered either by a USB cord or a 5 volt battery. The connector here consists of a disposable sensor chip. The chip is a carbon nanotube based sensor, same as the other one we used in the other demonstration. To start gathering data, you can simply hold down the selector switch. This bar graph shows the percent change in the resistance of the chip. When we glow on the chip, you can see the screen change. We can also push the button in to zero out the graph and it will use the current resistance as a baseline. This is automatically done when it starts. While it's gathering data, it also saves it to the micro SD card built into the screen. If we push down on the selector switch, we can go view the temperature and humidity sensor. And if we push down again, we can view the GPS. Currently, there's no signal inside the building, but when it's connected, it will show the date, time, longitude, and latitude. When we're done, simply just hold the button again to stop. To view the data, we can just take out the micro SD card and put it into the computer. We use another program to view the data. And from here we can save it into a file. Once we do this, we can simply open it up in Excel. After it's in Excel, we can simply graph it to view the results of the data just gathered. This concludes the demonstration.